So we are back another day, another Undertaker figure. We have the WrestleMania 35 Elite, which is actually Undertaker WrestleMania 33 Elite, because this is the attire he wore when he faced Roman Reigns, where he was supposed to retire. Roman beat him. He left his jacket in the had in the ring, then he came back at 34, then he didn't come back at 35, and after you watch the last ride documentary, he retired after the Boneyard match, which will be an epic figure to have one day. Maybe they really drop that next year. Maybe they drop a whole Boneyard set. But we're going to box this right now. Boom. There you go. It has the soft goods. Super soft goods. Look at that. No rubber, no anything. Got the extra pair of hands. So, let's, to get, let's get this out of here. So, again, Mattel does a thing where they like to add these little clip things at the back. So, uh, so you don't steal the figure or something. I don't know. People do figure swaps all the time. I feel like it's funny online to see, but if you saw it in person and you really wanted that figure, you really would really hate it. Did I break that? No, I didn't do it. So, okay, I count those out. Here's the Undertaker figure. We have the Undertaker hat. It's a little wavy, but there you go. There's the Undertaker figure. No, nothing on the side. Uh, nothing on the side. Just uh, old school classic Undertaker. It is an Elite. It has the articulation. Make sure to check your articulation. See if it's correct. And um, there you go. There's the Undertaker WrestleMania 33, WrestleMania 35 Elite of when he faced Roman Reigns. Very basic. I like I like how they make the sock. It's super easy to take on and off the jacket. But like, shouldn't have done doing this forever. Yeah.